You're listening to 90.3 KEXP online all over the world at kexp.org. My name is Charlize, host and producer of Audio Oasis, and it's now time for a live performance by Brianna Morella on KEXP.
You're listening to live music by Brianna Morella here on Audio Oasis. You just heard Danny and Surrender. And both of these songs are from the new album that's coming out on August 21st on Jagged Jaguar called All Around Us. Hi, Brianna. Hi. Thank you so much for coming here. Thank you. Um, I'm going to just personalize this a little bit and say that it's really nice to be in a room with your vocals. I really love your vocals. You have a very nice voice. Thank you. Yeah. So um, I want to talk about your history in making music because you are a Seattle native and this is your third release, actually, right? Mm. Well, Well, second. Well, technically. Technically your second. Okay. (laughs) But I I have Water Ocean Lake. Oh, yeah. Well, that was just like a cassette I made. Cool. <laughs> I mean, I don't you don't want to count that one? Uh, I guess. Mm, I don't know. Sometimes, yeah. you know, you don't like count like a mixtape or something. Yeah. Know? So it's like, <laughs> maybe it's like my mixtape or yeah. something. Yeah. <laughs> so you went to school at Evergreen. Mm-hmm. And you met some people there. Yeah. And you had, you have some really cool people that you mentioned in some interviews that I, I like a lot. Um, Johanna Kunin. Oh, yeah. Yeah. She was my voice teacher. Cool. She has, um, I, I remember her from when I was doing college radio, and I always thought her music was really beautiful. Oh, she's, like, still one of my heroes. Yeah. Like, I always looked up to her, to, like, so much. I, like, started taking lessons from her when I was, like, a really shy 12-year-old, you know, <laughs> and just, like, looked up to her so much. So you did vocal lessons with her. Mm-hmm. Um, but you you played guitar. Yeah, I even though Johanna um, played piano for some reason, I was kind of like, no, like I want to play like guitar music. Even though I was always like so kind of drawn to keyboards and stuff, but I, yeah, I don't know. I for some reason was like really into guitar, but then you know I you can see now I completely abandoned it. So. Yeah, you have all the hardware. <laughs> yeah. So um, you also mentioned Laura Veers and Carl Blau and oh, Ben yeah. came in. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I love those people a lot and love their music a lot. So I thought that was really cool that you found them inspirational. Totally. Yeah. I remember seeing like Laura Veers like play in like a coffee house like a long time ago, just like because she like knew Johanna and Carl and um, just like being blown away, you know, just like as a young, like preteen, teen just like to be inspired by someone who had such like a beautiful voice and like such amazing powerful songs. Like, mm-hmm. Yeah, another idol, Seattle or local Northwest idol. Yeah, for sure. Um, I think that you have amazing powerful songs. <laughs> <laughs> I've been well. I just listening to them lately. Um, you talk a lot about love and sadness and family, and I've been thinking a lot about that stuff mm-hmm. and. Listening to your music, it makes me feel those things. How do you how do you feel when somebody says that to you with your regarding your music? Um, I think that's good. <laughs> I'm glad I'm on the right track. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cool. Um, and so I want to talk about um, how you moved into making all around us. It has um, a very uh, influential tie that to to KEXP, um, you worked with Alex Summers, mm-hmm. who uh, produced the album. Yeah, and you went to Iceland to do that. And Alex Summers um, works with Sigaros. That's what his music or his um, work is known for. Mm-hmm. How did that happen? Um, well, it kind of all started off. Um, I had booked a U.S. tour in 2012 with my sister, and we toured around the country and we were in Providence, Rhode Island, and we played a show at a gallery that this like really sweet guy had pictures up on the wall, like, and his name was Scott and he happened to be Alex's best friend. And, um, I played and, or we played, my my sister and I, and, um, he like bought a CD or like a cassette or something. And then I ended up showing it to Alex later when I think Alex was visiting and Alex was just sort of like, oh, what is this? It's like interesting. And then kind of like just reached out and then we like talked over email like for almost a year. And, and then you then, headed to Iceland. Yeah. Cool. And um, the tour that you went on with your sister, do you have a musical family? Um, not 
fairy, my sister's musical. But, mm -hmm. um, I don't know. Not, no, not really. <laughs> does she, does she, well, what did she do when she, you guys went on tour? She was playing electric guitar and doing backup vocals. And she's kicked out of the band now? No, she's in school. <laughs> oh, yeah. And she's, she actually moved to Olympia. Cool. So where, is where I went to school, too. And, um, yeah, she's just kind of going to be in school this fall. So I wish she could join me, though. Yeah. I love singing with her. Oh, nice. It would be nice to hear you guys together sometime. And um, I want to talk about Surrender. It is such a beautiful song. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I love the loops and how it just feels like a hurricane of your voice and all this lovely stuff. Um, the video is really, really cool. And I featured it on the Audio Oasis Facebook because I thought that it was so nice. And I wanted to talk about who made the video and how you guys came up with the concept. Yeah, um, it was actually someone that, oops, sorry, that the label put me in touch with. <laughs> we'll get back to the music in a second. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. I, um, um, a woman named Kristen Turner who lives in Boulder, Colorado, and she's kind of like an experimental filmmaker, like really good at doing stuff with Super 8 and just like kind of approaching music videos from like a less narrative sort of standpoint, like some videos can be in... That was really what I wanted from that video was just it to be like kind of beautiful images and like processed through film and like really grainy and I think it really achieved that and it's really beautiful. Yeah, it's definitely beautiful. I I found it to be psychedelic and vintage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cool. Cool. Uh, so you have a couple more songs. Mm -hmm. Cool. We'd love to hear them. Okay. Brianna Morella on Audio Oasis on KEXP.
You've been listening to live music by Brianna Morella. You just heard further and take care of me. Also from the album All Around Us coming out soon. And All Around Us is named after a, ch- a children's book. Yeah, it's after um, I found a children's picture book from like the 1940s. There's this cool store in Olympia called Fun Junk, which is literally what the name is. Fun Junk. There's like lots of like fun, cool, old cool stuff there. And I found it there. And I just, I don't know, the name of that book always kind of struck me. And I just liked it. Do you feel like sometimes when you're writing your lyrics that you come from a childlike perspective? I think, I may, yeah, maybe. <laughs> I guess that's hard to self-analyze like that. But um, yeah, I don't know. I feel like I'm always trying to view the world as like a way of trying to understand things maybe like a child just like always trying to understand and like further what I know about things like yeah. love and relationships and friendships and stuff mm-hmm. um, I want to talk about um, for us the Odessa song oh yeah yeah because I thought it was really cool that your vocals were on that album are you um, going to be lending your vocals out to anyone else anytime soon um that I can think of. You're probably going to get a flood of requests now. <laughs> Maybe. Because of this interview. <laughs> it was it was really fun to do that, though. I was glad that they used it. It was funny just because I had recorded it for them like a while ago and mm-hmm. didn't expect it to end up on the album. And then all of a sudden they were like, hey, we're going to release our album. We want to use your vocal like vocals on that one song. So. Yeah, I really like that song. I really like that album. Yeah, it's a good album. Yeah, it's totally good. Beautiful. So you have an upcoming tour Mm -hmm. with Ginny Havel. Yeah. And that's happening August through September. Mm -hmm. And you're going to be going everywhere. Yep. What are you looking forward to most? Um, I'm kind of excited to go to parts of Canada that I haven't been before. Cool. Like Toronto and Montreal. Yeah, awesome. And let's see. So you have your Seattle show that's happening on August 29th at Barboza. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for coming here. This was quite lovely. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, very, very nice. So um, All Around Us comes out on August 21st on Jagged Jaguar. And you can keep up with Brianna at briannamorella.com. And she's also on Bandcamp and Facebook. You've been listening to live music by Brianna Morella here on Audio Oasis 90.3 KEXP Seattle. (laughs) Did I mess that up? (laughs) (laughs) discover new music at listener powered kexp.org